Hundreds of Uber drivers are protesting today in central London and are calling on the mayor, Sadiq Khan, to ensure that the company pays the minimum wage and for him to make workers' rights a condition of its licence. So today we're having a demonstration because two weeks ago in the Employment Tribunal, the judge ordered that we have worker rights. Now, it's going to take a while because Uber has decided it's going to appeal, but in May 2017, Uber's licence comes up for renewal. And the mayor has a duty to assess if Uber is fit and proper to hold a public license. And now what we're saying to the mayor today is that he must assess um, that Uber respects worker rights in order to continue to have an operator's license in London. Working 70 to 80 hours a week, which comes out according to the calculation which we just did here, it comes out to be £4 an hour, which is below the minimum wage. Yeah, in my knowledge, you know, the people are work, need to work like 30 to 35 hours, just cover the cost, like insurance and uh, car rental. If they're working more hours, only they can earn something. Uh, at least we are doing something for ourselves. We're not relying on uh, the operators or TFL, and we're putting some pressure into them, and um, hopefully uh, this will, uh, something will happen. Look, we have a race to the bottom. In real terms, we have a race to the bottom here in London. Drivers, circuits are flooded, drivers working 90 hours a week and five pounds an hour. That's dangerous. Your cars, just give way, let the orange lights out, okay?